In this video, we'll be talking about natal moon in Libra in the 11th house and what this placement means for you if it is in your chart or what it means for somebody else if it is in theirs and you are watching for somebody else. With that being said, what the moon represents is it represents emotional security and emotional needs and things that we depend on as a resource throughout life in order to get by or to get ahead. And it's almost like our foundation or um, what we build our lives upon. It's something that we develop. So when the moon is in the 11th house, this is about our network, our friends, our group, um, and our connections. And Libra is the sign of relationships. And it's the sign of others and our relation to others. And what I explained in the general Libra moon video, which I definitely recommend watching for more insight on this placement um, that I don't cover in these specific house videos. What I, but what I, anyways, what I covered is that um, the moon in Libra shows somebody that has a need to go to others to fulfill emotional needs or to share responsibility like they feel most comfortable in situations of shared responsibility or shared emotional accountability and with this combination of the 11th house this is somebody that likes to depend on their network or depend on their friends the natural sign that has the 11th house in libra is sagittarius which is all about freedom and um, travel and change and adaptability so these people gain emotional security from the freedom that comes from having a large network or a dependable network and having relationships with many people or with um with friends the moon shows things that come naturally to us and that we attract into our lives um and so these people attract a lot of relationships and connections they will tend to have a large network um, and even if that is not necessarily true in your case, or if that doesn't resonate, um, what this placement shows when the moon is in the 11th house is that you are also somebody that tends to be comfortable with strangers. The 11th house is about strangers, new communities, new people, and either you are very comfortable with strangers or strangers just get very comfortable with you very quickly. So, um, anyways, the moon shows needs. And when it's in the 11th house in Libra, this shows somebody that needs relationships that empower them and allow them to have more progress or freedom. Um, sorry, the better way to put it is the relationships that empower them or, uh, or progress them in some way and allow them to support their sense of self-reliance their individuality or their freedom. So often people with this placement will depend on others and on friends, especially for increased feelings of self-reliance and, and or freedom. So with this placement, you will tend to have relatively detached and logical relationships with others. And uh, friends kind of surface relationships. And you will be very broad in your uh, network and in your connections. Um, and so you will have an, impress uh, an impressive network of relationships, which gives you emotional security from the sense of freedom. And oftentimes you can find yourself depending a lot on friends when you have this placement you can find yourself in debt to others and the reason being is that when the 11th house is in libra the natural house that cancer is in is the eighth house cancer is the house of the moon so this is the ruler in your eighth house in your 11th house now most of you guys could have this placement but some of you guys don't have the eighth house in cancer um, but your moon sign is a um, Sagittarius rising placement, which 
Sagittarius has the eighth house in Cancer. Anyways, um, what the eighth house is about is it's about debt and inter interdependence and reliance. So when the ruler of the eighth house is symbolically in your eleventh house, um, this can show a tendency to become indebted on others or like to rely on their um, security or on what they have to offer and being very comfortable doing that. Um, so finally, this placement can make you relatable to a large group of people or to a community because the 11th house is about groups. Libra is about relatability. So these people feel comfortable in community or group situations. And um, this could be things such as a forum on the internet. This could be a group chat on social media or in a cell phone thread. Um, but the main thing is that they would tend to find themselves in some sort of groups. Um, and like they feel security from being able to rely on their network. So that's the best way to sum up this placement. Now, that basically covers what I wanted to talk about for this placement. So if you enjoyed or you saw yourself in any way throughout this video, then don't forget to leave a like and uh, subscribe to this channel if you'd like to see more content. If you would like a natal chart reading, the link is in the description to my Patreon, where I do a natal chart reading for each of my patrons. And there's also my email in the description if you'd like to contact me that way to book a reading or for any specific inquiries. Now, with that being said, I appreciate you guys watching and supporting in any way that you do. And I will talk to you guys sometime soon in another video. Thanks for watching.